Hey, what's going on? It's TJ, your sprinkler guy here. I just wanted to make another video on trenching. I seem to be getting a lot of views and a lot of comments uh, about the techniques and different ways to trench. Again, trenching can be for electrical, could be for plumbing. It really doesn't matter. Um, but I'm just going to go over again a quick way. As you can see, this is the line right in here that we're tapping into. And I already drew the blue line, but we got to go all the way to that corner of the fence. And this is grass. So what I'm gonna do again is I'm gonna take my trimmer, or my weed eater actually, I'm gonna weed eat this down, and then I'm gonna put the attachment for the, um, the edger. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna edge uh, the grass, because you really wanna cut it as you go. Cut on one side, cut on the other side, and then pull the piece of sod out. So what I'm gonna do here first is take the weed eater and I wanna cut down as much of this grass as I can. Um, again, we're, we need to trench such a long area. I don't wanna just keep cutting it because with, this is St. Augustine grass and it's very like stringy, okay? So you have to cut the grass, chop it before you can keep digging it out. It just makes life a lot easier. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and start this and let's just bang this out. <laughs> pointer here guys when you're getting using a weed eater and you're picking out string you know pick out the 0.95 if you can fit 0.95 it's a very strong strong uh string because you could see even though this was grass you know i got a steel uh trimmer here and this thing went all the way and you know the line didn't even break at all so if for you that weed eat a lot or have trouble with the string always breaking 0 0.095 uh, anything fatter just doesn't really fit much but I'm telling you you'll thank me later all right so let's take a look see so what I did was I just trimmed that grass as low as I can again this is not a front yard we are going to be putting a hedge all the way but I need to get that water line over here so step one was to cut this you see literally I think I cut I don't know three four inches off it it's just gonna make it a lot easier for the next step. So let's get this right. rolling. So I bought this. Uh, I didn't want to buy just a weed eater, a trimmer, and an edger. So this steel, I'm not sure what model this is, but it's pretty dope. So I already have the weed eater. I'm gonna take this off. Now I'm gonna put that, the edger. This slides right on. I have the trimmer. Um, so I can trim the hedges and stuff at home. So this is like a, a nice thing. Instead of having three different motors and three different things, there's one motor now. Well, let's get back to the lecture at hand. So here we are. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to go and take this edge and I'm gonna slice up one side and I'm gonna come back and slice down another side. Okay, again, the point of this is trying to, we're trying to pierce this grass right here because you can't shovel this. It's it, trust me, the St. Augustine, you know, different areas uh, of the world and the country have different grass, but this stuff, man, let me tell you, it's really hard shoveling long distance. So let's do this. As you can see, that only took a couple minutes. Well, probably like 10, um, but it's very important. Uh, it's so quick and easy to come out here with a shovel and start shoveling right away. But if you take your time, especially something like this, again, if you don't have an edger, if you don't even have a weed eater, you literally take a shovel one by one all the way down. You can break it up in sections. You can do however you do it, but you have to always pierce it. Again, we're gonna tap in there. All right, 
kind of see. Now, when the guys come here, they're gonna dig exactly where I need them to. So, that's how you do it. Take a little bit of time before you start digging. It's really gonna help you in the long run. People walk through here, so I wanna make sure we block this off, man. Safety, you always gotta protect yourself. We're minus one person. We're not gonna say because he's doing this. Oh, I didn't but that's my, okay. My gluteus. That's okay. Gluteus maximus. Yeah. Well, I definitely brought all of your camera. That's how you do it, guys. The best of the best, right here. <laughs> 